Officials haven't confirmed the identity of the person to CBS Austin just yet, but the woman we spoke to says the person was a man and she's heartbroken to hear he lost his life. I'm just devastated because he was such a fine man. Hug the ones let, that you love and tell them you love they love that you love them. Robin Stahl says she knew the man who lived in the house the fire happened at for years. She says she lived in the other unit in the duplex from 2010 to 2016 and got to know him well. It's really unbelievable um, to drive up and see it. I just I needed to see it um, for closure for myself because he was a very dear man, dear friend to me. I'm lost for words, really, um, because you never think that this is going to happen and you just wonder what happened. The Austin Fire Department posted about the incident on social media around 119 Saturday morning. AFD says firefighters were able to pull the person from the house. The person was then evaluated by Austin Travis County EMS medics and according to them, the person was in cardiac arrest. Attempts to resuscitate the person were unsuccessful and they were pronounced dead at the scene. Even neighbors who did not know the person well felt the loss. We like to engage the neighbors and it's sad when we, you know, lose somebody that's been here for a long time and uh, I know everybody's pretty upset about that. We're going to miss them. While CBS Austin was on scene, flowers were left in front of the house. Neighbors we spoke to say the man who lived there lived with his three dogs. I mean, his dogs were his life. A GoFundMe page for the dogs was started by neighbors. It states that all three suffered smoke inhalation and one has a bad second degree burn. The page is trying to raise money to cover their medical bills. Stahl also told CBS Austin that others were living in the duplex that caught fire. We talked to the tenants and they are doing well. They, they both got out safely and um, they're working with the Red Cross. Again, officials have not confirmed the identity of the person and the fire remains under investigation. In North Austin, Monique Lopez, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.